Okay, so a quick video to show you how you can measure electromagnetic force in the uh, environment in your house. Uh, you just need a simple um, voltmeter like this and you turn it to the alternative, alternating uh, current at 200, the lower setting. You take the ground wire, the black, and you connect it to a second wire and this wire has a ground only plug and so you plug this in here and basically that allows you to compare the um, amount of uh, current going through any sub uh, any uh, object compared to the ground which is a uh, metal post that goes a few feet under the ground and is outside uh, your house. So if I were to grab now the red wire here and put my fingers or, around it, and this would show you a voltage of two, which means that right where I'm standing without touching anything, being uh, in contact with any electrical devices, that's how much current there is in my body. If I put my hand on my iPad, which is not connected to anything, it does increase it just a little bit, two and a half. You take my hand off, now it's back down to two. But what I do want to show you here is that if I take the charge wire and connect it to this iPad, and so now I grab it again and just by plugging it in, I increased the voltage just a tad bit, but now I'm gonna go and put my hand on it. And now we went from two to 32. So for people who use their cell phones or their iPads and they are um, charging them at the same time, they're doing that, that's something dangerous. So uh, now, of course, the, the larger the contact area, the more voltage will go back and forth. So if I just have a finger, that's only 4.8, but then I can actually feel the electricity going through my finger. And if I were to hold the way that most people hold their iPad when they're using them, just that is going to give me 14 volts of energy going through my body. So probably something you want to avoid.